Welcome back and in today's video I'll be showing you how to set up mobile hotspot on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6. So start by opening the settings app and in settings ensure that connections has been selected. Under connections tap on mobile hotspot and tethering then from here select mobile hotspot. So to begin the setup process ensure that this is enabled and then you'll need to confirm that you want to switch off your Wi-Fi network before turning on mobile hotspot. So tap on OK. Then once it's been turned on, you should see this meter here that tells you how much mobile data you've shared in the day. And then you have your network name, your password, the bandwidth, your, and then you have auto hotspot, one-time password, prioritize real-time traffic, and the QR code option. So if you want to change the name of your mobile hotspot, simply tap on it, then enter in your new name. Then you can also choose to change the password and the bandwidth. So right now it's set to compatibility, but if you use the slider, you can increase to have it in the middle between compatibility and performance, or you can choose to have it set to performance. Then you can choose to change the security. So you can tap on the security option and have it set to open enhanced open personal a uh, different f version of personal and then the other version for personal then you have more advanced settings such as the mac address turn off when no device is connected hidden network and all sorts of options for you to choose from then once you finish with these customizations here tap on save to apply the changes and then you can continue editing your mobile hotspot. Then you have the auto hotspot, so only your account. You can choose to change that to have it set to family sharing, or you can simply turn that off. Then you can go back and you can choose to have a one-time password. So it means that whenever someone wants to connect to your mobile hotspot, they'll have to use one password. Then the next time, they'll have to use a different password. So it's up to you to enable or disable that option. Then if you want someone to connect to your mobile hotspot, instead of using the password, they can always choose to scan your QR code. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.